Everyone says EVs are cheaper to fuel, but how much cheaper are we actually talking about compared to a normal gasoline vehicle? If it was to multiply these two numbers together, I'm gonna to get a total of 1238, which is the cost to fill up the entire battery. Now keep in mind, for the most part, it's gonna be very rare you're gonna fill up an entire battery from zero to 100%. So this number here is the worst case for a full charge. So the cheapest place to charge up your electric vehicle is always going to be at your home. Of course, unless you're getting free charging from somewhere else. The nice thing also about charging up at your house is that you can just plug into a regular 120 volt outlet. You don't need to get anything fancy for day one. Next up is level two charging. This is charging that is gonna be quicker than level one and it's going to be where you're currently gonna find like at a workplace or a gym, shopping center, hotel. So here in Virginia, the average cost for level two charging is about 25 cents per kilowatt. Now, if I multiply these two numbers, I'm gonna get $18.75 for level two. And again, this is the worst case scenario to charge from zero to 100%. The last type of charging is level three charging or what is often called DC fast charging. This is the charging you're gonna to have to do on a road trip and it's going to be the fastest type of charging possible. In my regional area here, for me to hit a Tesla supercharger, it's gonna cost about 40 cents per kilowatt hour. So looking at that for 40 cents times 75 kilowatt hours in the battery, it's gonna be a total of $30 to fill up from zero to 100% for level three charging. However, you'll notice that for most really efficient EVs, it's still far cheaper as much as half the cost of what it would be for the gas equivalent.